Hi YouTubers, this is Justine, aka Just Wish Beautiful, and today we will be doing an unboxing. Really heavy box. This is the winter pop sugar must have box. This is the first time I've actually ever received this box. So I'm excited about it. I don't know if I'll be getting more in the future because it is on the pricier side. I think it's $75. And I think you get three or $400 worth of things supposedly inside. Um, your first box, there's tons of coupons you can find online for $20 off. And that's what I got this box. I think I paid $55 plus maybe sales tax. So it comes very pretty packaged. And we'll get into it. Oh gosh, it's heavy. Okay. The box, actually, I'd probably even keep the box because it's like a nice, oh no, it's just a nice box. All right. This is the little booklet. Um, I'm thinking that has everything that we're getting inside. So let's start with what I see first. And that is our book. It's called Whiskey in a Teacup by Reef Witherspoon, which it's probably one of the reasons this is so heavy. Um, this is like a hardback, thick old book. Has recipes. I'm not really sure what else it has all in it. But I would definitely take a look at this. Um, the suggested retail is $35 for that book. What? All right, next I see Wonder Beauty Baggage Claim Eye Masks. You get six pairs. I think I got these in a BoxyCharm box. Um, so I might, I might give those as a Christmas gift. This is a really good, like, Christmas gift time. I'll say that. These retail for $25. Okay. This was a spoiler we got. We got this white or, I don't know if it's white or cream blanket, which is really nice for a winter box to keep nice and cozy. And it's I'm trying to figure out who's it's who is it by Uncommon James, a hundred percent handmade cotton French throw. It says it is uh, dry clean only, but people are saying that they have washed it, undelicate, and hung dry it, and things like that before. And that retails for, I think it says $118 as a adjusted retail, which is insane, but it's still a nice blanket and it'll be a nice Christmas gift. I just love these boxes because I feel like even if I keep half the stuff for myself, half the stuff I can use as gifts for other people that are nice quality gifts. So that's exciting to me. All right. Next thing I see is this Melinda Maria Designs Sabrina Pod Necklace. Retail value is $98. Comes in a cute little gray package. You were able to pick the color of this, uh, either gold or silver. And I picked silver. I'm a silver girl, like, and I feel like I wish most subscription boxes at the very least would let you pick the color of your jewelry. I guess you could do it a second time and wrap it around or just, like, you can't tell. It goes kind of long if you don't do it a second time. 
But that'd be like really pretty with a sweater. Like it catches the light nice. It's pretty. It is pretty. I will say that. I will definitely wear that. Okay. So that I'll be keeping myself. All right. Next we have Winky Lux Sugar Kitten Palette, which I knew about this um, because it was a spoiler and I'm a sucker for a palette and it was like kind of sparkly, which makes me even more of a sucker. Like, those are supposed to be the colors on the back. And this is supposed to retail for $25. Oops. That's fair. The packaging is really pretty. It's like glitter, but like not the kind of glitter that like gets all over you. Ooh. Okay. Got some mattes and some shimmers. I think it'll be like blendable. I don't know. Not super pigmented, but pretty. Pretty, pretty. I'll be keeping that too. Add it to my palette collection. Uh, next is a candle. A tobacco Blossom Candle by... I'm going to kill the name of this, so I apologize. A pot peak. And this retails for $36. Well, if I don't like the smell of it, guess what's going to be another Christmas gift. Oh, that actually smells like... To me, it smells like baby powder. Like, it has a very nice, fresh smell. I actually really like it. It's not super strong, so I'm not sure how it's going to burn. I really like it, but I have tons of candles, so I probably will use that as a gift. But it is, it is nice smelling. I will say that. So... See, I already got half my gifts and half of the things for me. So, no, it's a great box. Yeah, I'll mess with that later. Okay, next we have a Kate Spade New York desktop easel calendar, which is really cute for 2019. Um, my aunt has an office job, so this would be a Christmas present because she'll get to use it. I don't have an office or anything, so that would be a really cute gift for her. I'm loving this box so far, and honestly, like, the packaging is really nice, and I don't know. It just, all the items seem like high-quality items. Like, nothing feels, like, cheap, um... Which is, like, really important because, I mean, you spend a nice deal of money on this kind of stuff. Uh, next. What is this? I don't know what this is. Uh, we have this thing for jet lag. And it's, I think it's an essential oil. I think this is considered like an extra freebie. It's like, there's all the stuff that we got and then it says, P.S. There's more. Like you always get like extra things too. Um, this is by Elia. Jet lag essential oil roll on. So this is supposed to give you like uplifting, put it on your pulse points and temples, back of your neck. Um, it's supposed to keep you alert and ready. Okay. I'm not going to open that just because I'm not sure if I'm going to keep it yet, but that's a really cool gift. I think I probably will keep it um, just when I go on vacation. Two more things. Uh, 
Oh, and there is also like a code thing in here for Wonder Beauty and then the jewelry and thing for the candle. Um, and it gives you coupons. So that's nice. If I give you the coupons for the stuff. Okay, this is Beautiful Bella. Estee Lauder perfume, roll on perfume. So, we will see what it smells like. Ooh, that is a really pretty bottle. Like, that is a really nice for travel to not bring your whole bottle. Okay, and it's a little, one of the little balls. It doesn't smell bad. Definitely like florally kind of. I hate to say it. It smells like older, rich person. I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. I mean, it's not for me, but it's, again, a nice perfume. And it is going to go in my gift pal. Okay. And last but not least. We have Lumify Redness Reliever Eye Drops. Okay. My eyes sometimes get irritated, especially like in the summer in the pool and stuff. So I don't have any eye drops. So it's just a little, looks like a little sample thing of eye drops. Okay. Um, overall, I am really happy with this box. Um, I think that it is really nice quality. Um, I liked a lot. Of, I probably kept half the stuff for me, and I plan on gifting half the things to other people. And they're really nice gifts. And I spent like $55 on it, and that's nothing compared to the value of everything that I had gotten in this box. Um, have any of you ever gotten pop sugar boxes? How does this one compare to other ones? I know that, excuse me, it used to be a monthly thing. And just probably, I think within the last year, they switched it to a seasonal box. So it comes four times a year. Just like FabFitFun. Except people seem to like the items, and I guess... The quality of the items I hear a lot more with pop sugar um, I don't know I love my FabFitFun so I'm just kind of curious what you guys think and your thoughts about this box and are you gonna order it and that's all subscribe like this video um, I love you all thank you for watching have an amazing day